Your weekday kickstart is here. It's time to live. Good morning. Your weekday kickstart is here. It's time to live, impact, value, and engage heart first. It's time for Live at 755 with Mitch Taylor. There we go. Now we're live. We got an issue with the webcam this morning. Sorry about that, folks. Uh, good morning. Welcome to live at 755 for this Friday, March 23rd. Sorry we had an issue with the uh, webcam there, but back up and running now. Thanks so much for being a part of the show. Thanks for watching. Uh, we've got, let's see, who is on so far with us? We've got Kevin, Michael. Thanks for being here. Today is all about you. Whatever you want to chat about, put in the comments below. We'll pick it up and talk about it here. Jim Collins, thanks for joining us. We've also, let's see, who else is on the feed here today? Uh, Frank Montanez, thanks so much for watching, Frank. Greatly appreciate your viewership. Uh, whatever you want to talk about, feel free to put in the comments below. Yeah, we had a blackout this morning, uh, John Price. Sorry about that. <laughs> it is what it is. We made it happen. Uh, so feel free to put in the comments below what you want to chat about here. Uh, very excited upcoming for Midwest DJs Live, where we have not one, but two international touring DJs will be spinning for us on Monday night of live. That's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, Stephanie, uh, good morning, Stephanie. One of my past brides is with us here. Uh, good morning, Stephanie. I actually will be in your neck of the woods here coming up on Monday, uh, flying out for vacation. Good morning, Dawson. Hi. And it's going to be a lot of fun at Midwest DJs Live for our Monday night event. Uh, it's, it's sponsored by RCF and DigiGames as well. And we greatly appreciate uh, our sponsors we have, EV is covering the uh, audio for the main room as well again this year. We'd like to thank our folks at ElectroVoice for sponsoring the audio for the main room again this year. And this year, of course, it's at uh, Potawatomi Hotel and Casino. How do you prospect corporate clients, Kevin asks. Uh, well, the first thing I would say, Kevin, in regards to that is you have to get involved in your community. And I've got a couple things upcoming here where we're getting a little more involved uh, we're helping out a venue with a BNI meeting upcoming where we get to showcase some of our work. And I'm looking forward to that opportunity. I'm involved also in Toastmasters, uh, which helps us. Good morning, Jeff Burdick. Thanks for being here. Uh, so there's many different things that uh, you can do to help prospect for corporate events. Check with your venues. You know, Find out if they're having any sort of upcoming corporate events and how may you help them in regards to AV. Uh, maybe they have their own AV system, but they don't have a master of ceremonies to run the awards banquet. Maybe, you know, people don't want to hear the boss drone on and on and on and you get my drift. <clears throat> so find ways that you can insert yourself, if you will, into the situation to help provide a service that is lacking for the event. And just find out. Say, hey, what was, uh, what was your last corporate party like? Talk to your friends, you know, that are in uh, in business, either Toastmasters group or maybe it's a Lions Club or whatever the case may be. But what was lacking at the last, uh, you know, company party you went to? They'll tell you. Well, what if I could help you with that? Who do I got to talk to? And then just move on from there would be my recommendation. Uh, everyone depends on what they want to do for the corporate thing. Uh, one of our guest DJs, Brian Bonacisi, just joined us. For the Monday night event at Potawatomi Hotel and Casino. Good morning, Brian. I uh, hope all is well with you, sir, and thank you so much for being a part of Midwest DJs Live 10. We're looking forward to having you. Brian is also kicking off uh, day two for us of Midwest DJs Live, so it's going to be great. Uh, Jeremy Albright, thanks for being here. Again, questions, it's free for all. Whatever you want to chat about here this morning, we're talking about it. Good morning, Howie Darkstar. Uh, thanks for being here. A DJ News stalwart. Uh, is Howie, and it's good to see him in Vegas, albeit briefly. 
Uh, again, whatever you want to chat about this morning, feel free to put in the comments below. I'd love to encourage you to get to Midwest DJs Live. It's going to be an amazing show upcoming. Uh, we've got great speakers. We've got Mike Walter kicking off the show. We're wrapping up the day with Maria Mattarelli, an international speaker who trains on Agile and will be teaching you how to adapt Agile to your DJ business brand, which is going to be awesome. Uh, Brian Bonacici has got a great seminar kicking off day two. And then we're wrapping up the whole conference with our closing keynote uh, with Bill Herman. Does the venue have restaurants, bars? Yes, absolutely, John Price. Uh, Potawatomi has several different restaurants. I think there's one main bar. There probably is another one. I'm not sure how many restaurants will truly be open on Monday, uh, but I know you'll have at least a choice of a couple uh, options to choose from for restaurants. So you actually don't have to leave Potawatomi if you don't want to. Of course, if you want to, you can, but then, of course, you got to fight traffic and get back. And, you know, that, that's another thing to think about in regards to, you know, getting in and getting out uh, for downtown Milwaukee and, and getting back in time for the nighttime activities uh, sponsored by DigiGames and RCF. Again, we're very thankful to have uh, them helping us out for the show. Anything else you want to chat about this morning, feel free to put in the comments below. We definitely want to uh, hear what you've got to, uh, what you got to talk about here this morning. Options to choose from for restaurants, so cold call or push the pavement, going to court. Pro oh, my goodness. I don't know how many you got there. Um, five to seven Monday, Jeff Burdick says. Jeff, might want to just clarify that. Uh, I'm not sure what you mean uh, for five to seven, but uh, just clarify in the comments below, Jeff, if you don't mind. Um, Kevin Porter, I'm not sure what you're asking. Yeah, cold call, push the pavement. I mean, it's just not really cold calling. It's you're already leveraging the contacts that you have and just connecting. Also, the Chamber of Commerce has been a great resource for me in regards to connections as well. Uh, I do an event for them every single February for a fundraiser where I'm the master of ceremonies for the event as well as providing um, background music, cocktail music, dinner music as well. Um, so I'm not sure. I think I hope I answered your question there, Kevin. Uh, again, Midwest DJs Live is the next big event coming up. Uh, it's going to be Sunday, April 29th. It's a welcome party. Uh, and that's going to be the D second annual DJ Big Ron spinoff. Just a bunch of guys getting together. If you haven't got your uh, opportunity to put your name in, again, feel free to do so. Reach out to DJ Big Ron Helmick. Uh, Ron Helmick here on Facebook uh, is where you'll find him. And check and see what uh, spots are left available for the spinoff. I know there are very limited spots left available for the spinoff. Um, <clears throat> okay, so Jeff Burdick just checked the restaurants. So it sounds like there's five to seven restaurants available for you uh, at Potawatomi for uh, Midwest DJs Live. So you've got a wide option, a wide array to choose from. I know they had one or two restaurants closed on Monday night uh, last I checked. So just a quick heads up on that. Neil McFarlane, thanks so much for joining us. Anything else you guys want to chat about this morning? Otherwise, we're going to wrap it for today i got a busy day ahead. We've got a, a corporate event, actually, ironically enough, Kevin Porter. i got a corporate event here tonight we're providing uh, multimedia support for, as well as photo booth services. And then tomorrow we'll be there for uh, a wrap-up uh, for the event, producing a video from, the, this, from today, actually. So uh, 3 to 5 will be open on Monday night. Jeff Burdick has also been a great resource for us as a Midwest DJs Live board member. Uh, Jeff has been our venue liaison. He's done exceptional. Uh, Big Ron and booze, what could go wrong in a casino? <laughs> You're right, John Price. We're looking forward to seeing you at Midwest DJs Live. Uh, Mr. White's, Adam, good morning, sir. Hope all is well with you. That's going to be it for today. Thanks so much for watching live at 755. Greatly appreciate your viewership. We'll be back on Monday with another session to help you live, impact, value, and engage heart first. Thanks for watching live at 755. We'll see you next time. Bye. Thanks for watching live at 755. To bring Mitch to speak to your organization, go to MitchTaylor.net. Now, go live, impact, value, and engage heart first.